Hey everyone, it's Harry from RM. Uh, you know, we're having a great time during our spiritual authority Bible study, and I'm just so pumped by some of the things that God has been, uh, you know, opening our eyes to really reinforcing in a lot of us as well, to go and exercise the authority of God in our generation. I want to take you to Ephesians chapter 6 today, and I want to remind you that indeed we have dominion over darkness. It says in Ephesians chapter 6 verse 10, Finally, be strong in the Lord and in the strength of His might. Put on the full armor of God so that you might be able to stand firm against the schemes of the devil. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the powers, against the world forces of this darkness, against the spiritual forces of wickedness in heavenly places. Hey, you know, a lot of us like to think that, you know, devils and demons and darkness is really just about scary movies. But the fact of the matter is, believers in Christ Jesus have a real enemy, and that's the devil. And when we think about the gospel message, we know that in the beginning, when God created the heavens and the earth, the devil was waiting to ruin things for man. But guess what? We now have authority by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of our testimony. We now have authority given to us by Jesus Christ in heavenly places and here on earth. If there are things going on in our lives, we know that the bad things that happen are a cause of spiritual wickedness. So what do we do? Do we need to turn every corner and, 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 and cast out a demon every second? No, none at all. In fact, we have authority from God and we walk on this earth like just like Jesus did. And we, we follow his example. This is what the Bible says, that when Jesus had approached the man with a, a demon, he had spoken and he said, go. That's it. That's all he said. He said, go. And the demons left him. That's all they did. He rebuked them and they left. And my friends, this is the reality of the believer. Yes, we have an enemy, but we don't need to struggle. We don't need to, ah, ah. No, on the contrary, use the authority you've received in Christ. Cancel the work of spiritual darkness and declare the good news of the Lord Jesus Christ to your generation, to the world around you. The world is waiting for believers, the manifestation of the sons of God to go and change their communities, to go and change the world, especially during this pandemic time, especially during the turmoil of the political landscape in North America right now. We can go forth with the power of God, declaring the gospel, expecting Jesus Christ to confirm the word and know that we have no devil problems, no spiritual darkness issues. We have the armor of God protecting us and we can cast out devils. Friends, trust that that was an encouragement to you. You have yourself a fantastic day taking authority in everything and in everywhere. God bless you.